Good morning, everyone. I wanted to take a quick moment to show you guys an agent's database uh, that I think is using the database correctly when it comes to reminders. Um, he's one of our top, he is our top agent in Tampa, Florida. His name's Mark Edwards. He's been our top agent in Florida for numerous years. Um, he has quite a few leads in his database, but he does a great job managing his leads and using the reminders to stay on top of them. Uh, real quickly, if you just look over here, uh, he's got eight in his active client database. If we look at those leads, pull them up, um, you'll see just about every single one of those has a scheduled reminder in place. This little black thing with an arrow means it's got a future reminder in place. So every one of these leads he's got set up to remind him you know, when it's time to contact. I think another point to point out in his database is it's not just his active clients. You go down here to the bottom and you create a prospecting list. I want to show you guys, um, we'll go to lead status. And we're going to pull up his prospects. We'll look at prospects. I'm going to look at his last contact. We'll just put in the last couple years here. Let's go back three years to 2017. And then we'll pull up the reminders, scheduled reminders. And we'll put scheduled. So you can see up here at the top, he has 550 leads in the last three years that are in a status of prospect. If we go to scheduled, we want to see how many of those he's actually got scheduled. 507 of those 550 leads or so have a future reminder in place for. So, uh, you know, he's not waiting for the leads to show back up on the hot list because they may never show back up on the hot list. You know, once he's talked to them or, you know, these are 550 people that he's, you know, either talked to or had a, some sort of conversation with it, you know, via text or email, he's made contact with these people. And now he's actually has a future reminder in place so that he can be reminded, you know, on the exact day when he should take a look at this lead and maybe follow up again. So I think Mark's doing a great job. I think you guys could too. Yesterday, my video was about active clients. I think you should you know, set up a prospecting list for your prospects in your database too. Make sure each one of those has a future reminder in place because there's no way that all of those people are going to show back up on your hot list. They're out using Zillow, Realtor.com, all of our competitors' websites. Um, we just can't rely on everybody, you know, using our website and showing back up on the hot list. All right. I hope everybody's having a great week I, and a great weekend. Talk to you later.